Well, look at this, a sunny start to our week, and we are tracking a warm-up. Still bright out there. KCAL's Danny Roberti here now with your next weather forecast. Hi there, Danny. Hey, Susie. Yeah, we're talking 70s and even 80s wow. by the time we get to next weekend. So, yeah, we've got a big warm-up in store for us, and it is nice just to see the light out there right now. Sunset's going to be just before 7 o'clock this evening. Here's a live look at Catalina. We're in the upper 50s right now. Sunrise tomorrow right before, excuse me, sunset tonight. Uh, as I mentioned, 659, so right before 7. Really pretty view right now. Now. Uh, we've got a few clouds out there and we are getting a nice break from the rain. No rain this week. We're going to be talking about morning clouds and afternoon sunshine, windy midweek, and then it gets even warmer this upcoming weekend. So tonight lows are dropping into the 40s and the 50s. So not as cold, but you do see a lot of 40s out there still, especially in areas like Santa Clarita, high deserts, mid 40s. In Lancaster, 47 in Simi Valley. We've got 54 on the board over in Santa Ana, upper 40s in San Bernardino, Riverside, you're dropping to 50. So I'd grab a jacket in the morning. You won't need it long. These are our temperatures, our highs tomorrow afternoon. It's going to be a beautiful day and it's going to feel warmer than today. Mix of clouds and sunshine. So we will start a bit gray right there near the beaches and in the valleys even. Upper 60s on tap though for the valleys, LA, Orange County, mid 60s for the beaches and in the Inland Empire with these low clouds out there, we could get a little bit of drizzle, patchy drizzle popping up early tomorrow morning. But once we get to the afternoon, things are going to be looking good and warming up. But let's talk about the winds. Once we get to Wednesday into Thursday, we're talking about our first kind of moderate Santa and a wind event potentially developing. So it's going to be those northeasterly winds. Uh, here's a look at Thursday, early Thursday morning, 5 o'clock, and you can see those winds developing in some of those wind-prone areas. We're really talking 35 mile per hour range to 55 miles per hour. So areas like the Inland Empire into Orange County, Ventura County right there, High Deserts, Lancaster, really picking up by about 8 o'clock Thursday morning, strengthening at that point. So the morning time, it's going to be a little bit blustery out there on the roads, and then it, it will stay breezy in the afternoon, but but not too windy, staying breezy Friday, Saturday, going into Sunday. But kind of the peak of this event, it's really going to be Wednesday night going into Thursday. Besides that, though, we are warming up. The winds are going to help us do that. And we are getting a break from the rain, which may last 10 plus days. Wait until you see the seven day. But whatever you want to make uh, plans outside for next week, and you are going to be good to go. Let's take a look at the next seven days. Temperatures that are going to be on the rise quickly. We've got big high pressure that'll take control. So upper six tomorrow in LA, Orange County. The 70s are back Wednesday, Thursday, going into Friday. Overnight lows also climbing. We're only dropping to 57 on Thursday. And then this upcoming weekend, I know it might only be uh, Monday, but we're always looking at the weekend. Saturday and Sunday, you're going to be in the mid 70s, nearing 80 degrees by the time we get to Monday. Inland Empire, same goes for you. Lots of 70s out there. Mid 60s tomorrow, low 70s Wednesday. You drop just a couple degrees on Thursday, but you hold on to the 70s this upcoming weekend. I mean, it is going to be so glorious out there, 77 on Sunday. And Susie, we got an 80 on the board oh, next Monday. Wow. So spring is right around the corner and it's actually going to start to feel like it too. Or maybe summer like. I My know, goodness. right? Danny, thank you. Start your day with KCAL News Mornings, 4 to 11 a.m. Driving in Southern California can be, well, you know, slow. KCAL traffic keeps you moving. With the where, when, and which way to go. Be prepared for now and what's next. Next traffic on KCAL News. CBS News Los Angeles. Your local news. Streaming wherever, whenever.